Adding fillets can often be a tedious process, especially when the geometry you're working with is complex. Fillet Expert makes the filleting process more flexible, allowing you to create multiple fillets at the same time, resolving geometry problems, and making it possible to selectively resize fillets you've already created. Let's take a look at these capabilities using this sample part. Fillet Expert is not a separate feature, but rather added functionality within the fillet feature you're already familiar with. I'll launch the fillet feature to bring up the fillet property manager. At the very top, you have the option to select fillet expert. When it is selected, the property manager changes slightly. Notice the different types of fillets are no longer listed. Fillet expert functionality is only available for constant radius fillets. In fact, if a fillet type other than constant radius is selected, the fillet expert button will not be available. First, let's take a look at the benefit of having the Apply button available in Fillet Expert. I can enter a radius value, 0.25 in this case, select the cyan colored face, and click Apply. The fillet has been applied, but the property manager is still here, making it possible for me to continue adding more fillets without restarting the fillet feature. I'll select the magenta colored face, and click Apply again. To dismiss the property manager, I'll click OK. Notice two individual fillets have been created. This is important to note. If you intended for these to be a single feature, you could have selected the cyan face together with the magenta face before applying the fillet. Fillet Expert can also automatically invoke Feature Expert when necessary. I'll launch the fillet feature once again. Notice the property manager is already showing Fillet Expert. This setting is remembered from the last time I used the fillet feature. This time I'll select the two brown faces and click Apply. You might recall from the previous exercise that this fillet results in an error. Because we're using Fillet Expert, the errors are automatically resolved by invoking the use of Feature Expert. When I click OK, you can see two additional fillets have been added. Let's launch the Fillet feature once again to see another powerful application of Fillet Expert. Earlier I added a fillet on this cylindrical feature by selecting the cylindrical face. This means that a single fillet feature is responsible for two edges being filleted. What I'd like to do now is change the fillet radius on just one of the two edges. In the past I'd have to edit the fillet, redefine it so it only contained one edge, then I could create a second fillet to control the radius on the second edge. This procedure is not difficult, but it can be time consuming. Now we no longer have to go through this process. All we do is enable the Change tab in the Property Manager and select the fillet we wish to change. I'll enter a value of 1 inch and click Resize. I can also select the filleted edge and click Remove. Fillet Expert will make any necessary changes to my Feature Manager tree, such as creating new fillet features, deleting features, or reordering features is required. Before I click OK, notice I also have the ability to select sets of fillets using the radius value here in the existing fillets list. This is a convenient way of making changes to all fillets having the same radius. At this point, I'll click OK, and you can see that what used to be a single feature controlling the size of both fillets on the cylindrical boss has been broken up into two separate features automatically.